What's up guys to another unboxing video. Before I get to the unboxing, I really just want to say, um, I'm trying to get a job again, um, at GameStop. And this time, I have a lot better luck. Um, last time I tried to get the job was July. They never called me in for an, an interview. Thing is, none of the, no one there knew me, right? I talked, and uh, I didn't talk to anyone. I just got the application, turned it in. This time, I went over there to the uh, to uh, GameStop, and not only did I turn uh, the day I went and picked up the application, this is what I did. The boss was there, the manager of it all was there. What I ended up doing was talk to one of the employees, said, "Hey, uh, you should talk to Eddie about it and be persistent." And I thought, you know what? I'll do that then. So I go and get lunch and I come back and there's the manager. A guy's uh, tra looking into trading in three games, right? Not buy anything. He wasn't going to. And I, and I hear him talk about something about Spider-Man. I'm waiting in line to turn in my application. I wasn't even going to do this. So uh, I walk away and my mom says, what are you doing? And I'm like, just watch. I go over and I say, hey, you're looking for a Spider-Man game? And he thinks I'm an employee, right? And, I, and he's like, what's the difference for this Spider-Man 3 and the one with the red and black cover for the PS3? And I said... Um, I don't know. Do, like, uh, for example, like, do you know uh, where he, where the case is? He goes and shows me. I said, "Oh, it's because this is a collector's edition. It's an extra. Tw uh, it's twenty four dollars. This one's twelve. This one, uh, the collector's edition, only comes with the new Goblin as a new character. You know, I, in, in my opinion, I wouldn't sell it. I mean, I wouldn't buy it. See, you have to give a negative. Best way to the you know sell some. Oh, cutting myself. Um, best way to um, sell a game is do this. Hey." This game is not really good. Yeah, I already played Spider-Man 3. I just wanted to know the difference. Well, if you want to know what a good Spider-Man game is, pick up Web of Shadows. I picked up the Web of Shadows game. I said, here, this one, if you can get by, by, uh, past its flaws, it's you're in for a great game with a great amount of hours. And it's like, okay, I see you. It's $24, uh, $24 I mean, $25, oh, $24.99 used, right? And so... He looks at Liberty City store, um, in li uh, episodes of Li Liberty City, the Grand Theft Auto for PS3. I said, see, you can get that for 28, but you could go and get this one, pick it up, buy this one, which comes with all three games, Grand Theft Auto 4 and those two, for $40. Just at an extra 12. And he's like, you know, you're working it over here. And I'm like, yeah, and I don't even work here. He ends up buying those two games, and then the boss was, was smiling. That helps my luck a little bit more. But today, when I turned in my application, what I did, uh, what I did just now was yesterday. Today, I turned in my application. Come to find out, the one person I knew from El Cerrito um, GameStop transferred, which made my luck even better. And she's gonna get a, put in a good word for me. So that's just even better. Well, anyway, I just wanted to say I'm trying to get a job at GameStop. Things are looking pretty well, but at the same time, who knows? They say they really need a bilingual, um, bilingual uh, speaker, like. Like someone that speaks uh, Spanish and stuff like that, like two languages. I can't do that, so I'm hoping. But anyway, that's besides the point. I just wanted you guys to know that I'm, I'm trying to get a job. And at GameStop, that would just make this channel even better. Because I would save up, get a better camera for much better quality, and all that kind of stuff. You know? Better for you guys, better for me. There you go. Anyway, let's get to the, to the unboxing of Two Rolls 2. Brand new. I was looking forward to this game. I know the first one sucks. Um, but, you know, this one... I heard some good stuff about it. It's not perfect. Voice acting sucks, apparently. But I'll also be doing a playthrough of this um, after uh, Batman Arkham City. I'm not even going to put this in the game, uh, the system until uh, I beat Arkham City. Put those stickers on here. So, bam. Bam. There's the back, if you can see it. There's the cover. Open it up. No codes, no nada. Okay. Here's your manual, here's your CD, let's open the manual. It's a full book manual in color. You know, see that? It's in colors. It's just brown and white and like tan and shit, but still color, you know? And hey, at least it still has a manual. Most fucking game companies are not even putting a manual and shit no more. It's like a one page little thing with four things of ink on each side. What the fuck? But anyway, there's your unboxing of Two Worlds 2. If you look forward to the playthrough right after uh, Batman Arkham uh, City, well, actually, no. My Halloween special is coming after um, Arkham City. Depends, actually, on when I finish Arkham City. But I have a Halloween special coming after Arkham City, hopefully. And so keep your eyes out on that. And this probably will come after my Halloween special. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, guys. And see you guys in the next vid. And comment what you think about me going to GameStop. That would be awesome because, you know, I want to know your opinion on that. 
I'm hoping to God that they accept me for the job. So, I already gave them a good smile on their faces and a good idea of what I can do. You know, I have good gaming knowledge. Ask me anything. I'll answer it. Peace out, guys. See you guys in the next video.